All right, guys, I know I'm a day late on this video. I'm really sorry. Uh, but the person who usually does these events had a, a problem, a personal problem to attend to. So send Darren our love, okay? But also, um, I just literally lost track of what day it was. I genuinely thought it was Tuesday yesterday, but it was Wednesday. And that's the video, the day I usually upload this video. But uh, I'm going to upload it today on Thursday instead. I set the society event for today. It's uh, this course here, Fragiliana, Spain. I got this suggestion in the last course. It's a World Cup of Design course. Apparently a little Spanish town on uh, the sea. So we'll, we'll have a look. We'll see how this plays. Uh, 266 people played in the last society event. So I just want to thank you all for playing. Uh, wait, why has it not started yet? When can it start? Can it not start it now? When does the next event will begin shortly? Oh, it doesn't. I thought it begins at 9 a.m. If I'm being honest. Maybe it's 10 a.m. Shit. But anyway, guys, I'll just show you guys here. Um, 266 people played in this event. I actually came 20... Oh, it said I came 26th. I guess I came tied for 35th. It said I came 26th, this lying game. Uh, Team Canada won it at 18 under, so he had an average of a birdie every single hole. Honestly, I could have been, like, up there in the tie for 9th as well if I had played the last hole any, any bit better. I could have definitely been at least 12 under, but I, I completely bottled the last hole. And that is unfortunate, but I guess I'm gonna have to wait around and see um, if this event starts at 10 o'clock. I'm wondering if there's a way I can make it start now. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. My name here is John go. McCarthy, and we are about to play some golf here on the TGC Network. Let's go, baby! This next event is one round only, and we are just one round only, and I'm gonna going. absolutely pop off. First We're starting with a par five again. I think action. we started with a par five last week, did we? And we ended up eagling it. I think. I can't remember if we started with a par five or if it was. A, I can't remember exactly, but uh, no matter what, I'm gonna eagle this. It doesn't even matter. They call me the Eagle King. No one calls me that, but at the same time, it would be cool if they did. This is cool, though. The the little town up there on the hill. And we are down here in the water. Oh, yeah. Kinds Perfect. Of possibilities ahead here, folks. Perfecto to, to start off the round. And we should be able to go at that in two and give ourselves maybe a little hefty Eagle chance here to start off the round. I don't know. It's uphill, though. It might be quite difficult to get this to, uh, From to get up onto that back tier. Hmm. To Hmm, I'm wondering. Yeah, because this isn't going to reach no matter what, but this is 100% going to be too far. Like, I know it's going to be too far, but at the same time, it's really, like, the only option that we have, unfortunately. I hate when you're stuck between clubs like that. It's the worst. We've done as good as we could possibly do there, but it's not going to be brilliant, is it? It's going to be off the green. And we'll chip back across and hopefully get a birdie. Oh, we might stay on the green here. Okay, no, we're not. It's gonna stay going for ages and 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 ages. Club on that, I think. All right, let's go. Should we flop this? I'm thinking maybe flop this. Ooh, I don't know if I should or not. Ooh, I don't know. Screw it. I'm going for the flopper Rooney. We're starting off hot with the flopper Rooney. I should not call it the flopper Rooney to be honest, but what can you do? Oh, sit the fuck down. Like, how is that going so far? Oh, thank you. Stay there. Don't you dare go down that little ridge. Don't you dare. Oh, thank the Lord above. Thank him. This one's I want to thank Twitter. him today for everything that he's done in my life. Oh my god, this is a hard break at the start. I'm playing golf in real life today as well, boys. And tomorrow. I'm playing back-to-back -back days for the first time in a long time, to be honest. But is that going to be... No, you've got to be kidding me. You've got to be kidding me. We're going to par the first here. And, and that is quite depressing. We really should have had a birdie. I'm just going to go delete the event real quick and restart the whole thing. Because no one else has played yet. So it's fair in my opinion. And I'm kidding, of course, guys. I wouldn't do that. Oh, no. There's an Irishman playing already. A fellow Irish brethren. SPG515. What's up, bro? And now let's move to the second My one. Irish brother. My Irish brother in arms. Right, what are we going to do here? 11 mile an hour winds here, so I'm going to just absolutely take it over this bunker here. Because it's downhill as well. We'll be fine. Nope, that was a horrific swing, trust me. That was and a good one, though. a huge drive here. Alright, I need to start making some birdies to make up for that stupid little bitch bar on the first. Let's go. Let's go. Let's freaking go. 
Ooh, this is a tough one because they have that little ridge right before the green. These are tough pin positions, man. Like, legit. Really difficult. They don't make them easy, that's for sure. Damn, they don't make them... Come on, come in off the, off the left there. Come in off the left. Oh my god, it's way too far. I thought I put a bit of loft on that, but still, I guess, way too far. That's crazy. We have to be careful of the ridge behind the hole here now, because... Um, I'm not chipping this. There's no way. Ah, uh, no. That's not going to come into play even. Well, it is if we hit it way too hard, but we shouldn't hit it way too hard, should we? Not that. That feckin' hard anyway. There's no way. Did I hit it hard enough? Please tell me I hit it hard enough. Please tell me I hit it. Oh, I did. I did. But it's... No! Ooh, inches, inches Dude, I've away. been robbed on the two putts. I've been robbed on the two putts so far. No, don't you dare. Oh, my God. I thought it was going to keep going. Yeah, I was going to literally lose here. my mind. We've got robbed on the two birdie putts so far. Really, though. That's depressing. Yeah, that one will drop. I'm actually playing decent golf as well here, but it's and just uh, that hole, he will remain getting a bit unlucky. Run. Not unlucky, even. I just like the putts are burning the edges. In store. Burning the edges, son. It's a nice course, though. I like it. It's solid, you know? Every course doesn't need to be spectacular, but this is solid stuff. And the views are really nice. And oh no, I hit it fast. Bunker bound. Serious power involved oh in no, one. it's well over the bunker. Wow, okay. We're fine. It's a sh quite a short course. Like, every hole I'm uh, coming in with something, you know, not too crazy. I'm pitching most of the shots in, so far anyway. That is so far. Uh, this is going to come back down off the hill here if I hit it in the right location, which I should be able to. That's going to come back down off the side. Come back down a little bit more. A little bit more. All right, it's decent. Not brilliant, but it's decent. And this putt's for birdie. Should be our first birdie. Come on, man. Yeah, there's no way I missed this. Come on. Why did I, why did I just do that? Why did I just do that? This My finger got caught up. Feet it. Away. No, I'm not even going to talk about that. We're not going to talk about that even. I have literally a, a tap in birdie, pretty much, if I just actually hit it properly. He's like, right where he is, even that was an easy that putt. And the first two I burned it. the edges on, and that one I just, I do, like my finger, as I was bringing back the analog, got cut up in the top part of the analog. Like, not where the, not the actual analog, but where the analog is. It got caught up there, so my, my analog didn't push all the way forward. So I was like, really? That's how we're going to miss the birdie putt? That it is sounded, depressing. Uh, sounded powerful off the club. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, this shit only happens to me, I swear to God. Like, it only happens to me. I'm so dumb. Like, I'm so dumb, it's crazy. That was the easiest putt you will ever hope to make. And the other two were difficult, but I finally got an easy one, and Man, but a buck that happens. Away. Of course. Of course it does, you know? Oh, I'm definitely not going up a club, that's for sure. I'm going to actually put a bit of loft on this nearly. No way that was very fast. There's no fucking way. I can't believe that was very fast. Like, I simply find that impossible to believe. Very fast! Like, I did not push that forward very fast. For birdie. At all. Oh my fucking god, you're kidding me with this. Like, there's nothing I can even do to make this reasonable. <laughs> like, absolutely nothing I can do to make this reasonable. That's about as good as I could have hoped for, honestly. What a putt. No way. Slow down, slow down. It's beautiful putt, really. Like, that's about as good as I could have hoped for. If it was a little bit less on it, maybe, but I feel like then it would have had the risk of going way further down. Come on, give me at least one putt. This is the par putt. Let me make the par putt at least, man. Come on. Nope. Ooh, and that one I can't make a putt again! I can't make a putt again, putt dude. Promoting. Like, holy shit. I've had... Four reasonable reasonable putts on the first four holes, and I haven't been able to make a single one of them. Burn the edge on three of them, and then the one on the third we won't talk about. We just won't talk about them. We're one over. I should genuinely be two or, two or three under, and I'm one over. This is the most apex round you'll ever see in golf. Like This is absolutely typical of me, honestly. Uh, I don't know if I should hit the 108 here or what. Like I'm genuinely debating hitting the 108, because I feel like... I don't know. I feel like 122 is going to be too much.
Yep, that's pretty damn good, actually. Now, come on. Let's make a bounce back birdie. I always bogey after making right, a uh, after making a birdie, so let's to birdie go. after making a bogey. All right, this is an easy putt. If I don't make this, I'm genuinely not joking. I'm logging off. Ooh, that was very close. Guys. This Guys. This one looks about uh, four feet. Guys, is this like a, a prank or something? And the putt will drop. Is Ashton Kutcher going to come out and say you've been and punked? That hole, one over for the day. Because this is... This is quite unbelievable, and to be quite perfectly honest. It's here. unbelievable. Like, I find it simply hard to believe that this is happening in front of my own very eyes. I can't believe it. It's about as good of a drive as you can hit in your lifetime. But I can't wait to hit this this second shot relatively close and then miss the putt. <laughs> Dude, I genuinely, I'm, my mind is boggled as to what is happening. Five holes in, and I just yeah, don't even know. Five yard I just don't even pin. know. I just don't even know what's going on in my mind. Be enough. No. Even with the D loft, that was never going to be enough. Unfortunately, I had to hit the 122 with a little bit of loft. There's definitely and, no way uh, I'm making this putt, like that's that. for sure. This would yeah, be the one I would probably four. make then. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. I'll probably three putt this, actually. Enough of that negativity, boy. It's a good putt. Oh my land. That's that a good was, putt. Uh, but obviously we're not making that one. This putt's for par. Very, very difficult. This putt's for par. Screw off, mate. Screw and off, mate. Will drop. Screw off, mate. I'm so and sick of it, lads. On the day after that hole. I can't make a birdie. Like what is happening? I should Oh, this is a cool hole. That's someone's house right there. They got the net up, that's understandable. I mean, if I was if I was living there, I'd still be terrified, dude. If someone hit a slice, like slice the shit out of their drive, that could go right of that net even, and bang! One of those windows smashed through. I would not be okay with that. But look at this. This is dope. This is definitely the screenshot. Oh, that was awful. That was truly awful. One of the worst drives you'll ever see in your life, to be quite perfectly honest. I didn't even hit 100% power. Um, but I don't really know what's going on today. Like, there's something wrong in my brain, I feel like. Okay. Like, something's happening inside of my brain that's not... I think it's too early. Like, it's not even 10 a.m. yet. And, uh, things are just, you know... Clearly not going very well, I would say. Would be the understatement of the year. 60... I don't know if this is even enough. No, I'm hitting the 225. Legit. A little bit aloft. I think this might be a bit long. Come back off that ridge, though. Don't you dare get caught up up there. Come back off that ridge. 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 Let's go. Slow down now. Slow down now, Betsy. Oh, come on. Really? It's going to... It's like that. I thought it was going to stop up near the hole. It's going to keep on going. Nah, it's not too bad. This one is on the green. It's not the worst. A lengthy putt ahead. A lengthy putt ahead. Can we make one for once? This one's not that difficult, but, I mean, I've had way easier ones than this today and I've still missed them so can I finally make one and this shot is looking scary let's go right finally <gasps> finally oh the rock so has bad. come back to the golf club <laughs> we're back to level par and let's go baby plate is that's what I'm talking global. about son that's what I'm talking about baby all right uh, should we hit driver I feel like I should, but there's a lot of out-of-bounds down there, so I'm kind of scared to. But I still did anyway, and I'm probably going to be out-of-bounds here. No, we're surely not going to be out-of-bounds. Don't be out-of-bounds. Oh, he's going through the, through the branches here, and he can't be too happy with that shot. Oh, I thought it was going to be out-of-bounds. I thought that marker was marking the out-of-bounds. Holy shit, that was close to being. Very close to being, for sure. For sure. Go on, be enough. Be the right distance today, sir. It's absolutely picture perfect. Get in the hole. Get in that hole. 
You're kidding me. Oh, oh man, I thought we'd made the eagle. That would have been real nice. That would have been really, really nice. And that would have made up for a lot of the earlier shit. But of course, it had to just stay out. It looked like it was going in all the way there, to be honest. But we'll take it. We're, we're back under par. Nice par four. This is a par four. The question is, do we go for it? Are we a pussy? Are we a pussy or no? That's the question I have to ask myself every day. And I'm going for it. I don't even care. If I was doing really good this round, I'd probably lay up, but I'm not. So I'm going for it. Oh, that's absolutely splendid. Get a big bounce. Big bounce. Go on, get up there. Wasn't a big bounce, but it wasn't a really small one either, so we'll take it, and we have an eagle putt. Wow. We nearly had an and eagle on the last. Maybe we can uh, make up for it by making an eagle here. This is definitely not an easy four. putt, though. You can tell right at the end here, it breaks a lot to the left. The thing is, though, it doesn't break much to the right at the start, so I think we can just play it like it's, like it's breaking out to the... Like this much, maybe? Is that too much? too much pace there's definitely too much break as well but there was 100% way too much pace on that be lucky to make the birdie now it's about nine feet away nine feet away come on please for the love of God don't do me like this I missed it oh my god yeah, oh my god I nearly had too much pace birdie. on that one as well holy shit Ooh, I would have been upset there that's three birdies in a row though is it I think it's three birdies in a row now setting up for the yeah it is this, this course is absolutely stunning. Like, wow. I'm really impressed by this course and whoever made it. I think his name was at the start, but I can't remember it. But yeah, dude, great job with this course. 100% brilliant job. This cliffside course like with the village around the place the as well, it just makes it even better. It's like there's so much thought and, and effort went into this course and you can tell I really like it. The views were stunning. It started off kind of like tameish, I would say, compared yards. to the holes that are here now. Uh, but they were still nice holes with the village in the background and stuff. But I'm just saying, like, in comparison to these cliffside holes, they were a little bit tame. But now it's just picking up and being kind of nuts, really. Oh, please be the right nine distance. Nine. The wind is affecting that a little bit more than I thought it would, honestly. It is the right distance, but it's going to keep going because of that hill there. A little bit. It's not the end and of the world. Approach is on the green. Not the Let end of the world, ahead. man. It's not the end of the world. How can I... Uh, oh, one sec. My watch is messing up. I just need to end that walk that I was on with my dog. It was uh, coming up that I was still on a walk. I don't know why. All right. Um... Probably because I'm walking the golf course on the Golf Club 2019, baby. Can we make it four in a row? Question mark. If I'd hit it hard enough. If I had hit it hard enough, and he just and about does. It's four birdies in a row. Very nice Let's freaking go. We should be so much better. That is the story of my life, though. Story of my life. Why are we tied for first, by the way? There's no one else playing. <laughs> Why are we tied for first? I don't get it. Oh, wow. This is pretty. This is pretty, pretty, pretty. Okay, I'm definitely... Uh, I'm going to hit the 160 here. This is risky. It's not really risky because it's definitely going to be enough, but it might be a little at the front of the green. Oh, no. Oh, no. That's completely in the water. It actually would have been perfect, the probably. Iron was a bit too much. Please bounce right. And unfortunately, he's ended up in the water here. Oh, I'm a fucking idiot, dude. I, I was like, that was the one hole that you just simply cannot hit it fast on. The one hole. Like, any other hole, if I had hit it fast, it wouldn't have been that bad. But I picked the one hole where you simply can't. Like, you just cannot do it at all. And that's the one. I, I've been hitting it perfect all day, pretty much. And then I choose this hole to do that, of course. Like, what do you, what do you think? Come back down to the right a little bit, please. Nope. That's uh, going to shoot on. And uh, this has just completely ruined our four birdies in a row. 
And it's a big uh, feet to the cup. Jesus, man, that's depressing. We're going to get a double here. Right after making four birdies in a row, I stop it with a double. This is the most apex round you'll ever see. And I should have already been way better than three under anyway, but now we're going to be back oh, to one. That was, that was very close. If I can make this, I might triple this and give away all of my birdies. And this that would be pretty funny, huh? The double bogey. Shut up. Just about. Solid just five. about, honestly. This is a yeah, great course, but I'm I'm just messing up uh, on simple day. things. Like I, I imagine getting a double bogey hole. there. Like if I had just hit that 160 flat normal, it it probably would have been perfect. Like I'm I'm pretty sure actually that it would have been very good, very good, and that's a perfect drive as well. This is a par five. It's definitely uh, definitely gonna be reachable, I think. Maybe not from out here, actually, because I did go. I, I did kind of go far out to the right. I didn't want to risk bringing that cliff into play. That little and dip he there. We'll like that. No, we can't reach it all. I don't think we could have reached anyway. There's no way, no matter what. Good second shot, though. Unfortunately, well, this is a tough call. Could be rough. Could be fairway. It's definitely rough, but it's not going to be the end of the world. Should be able to flop it up over the bunker and get this close. Maybe make a birdie. Get back on track. That'd be nice. <laughs> Can't believe that just that shit just happened, transpired though in front of my very eyes. See, the weird thing about that is that one right there was the one that I felt like I pushed that forward really fast. I was like, this is gonna be fast, I think. But it wasn't even. It was slow. Like I'm yeah, so confused forward. sometimes with these uh, uh, with these things, man. I don't know. I don't know. We'll forward. take the birdie though. We'll take the birdie after the double bounce back and birdie. So our last two under for the day. Our last six holes were birdie, 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 double bogey, and then birdie. Like what? Like you gotta now be shitting me with that. Off. Come on. Goodness. Par four. Not good at all, man. Not good at all. Ooh. I don't know about this. Is this going to be too far? Well, this one could be either way. Folks. That's an absolute sure, beauty. Uh, if it's going to be safe or See, I was not. like, yeah, it's way downhill. So, oh, no. Don't, don't, don't. At least it didn't go into the heavy rough. We're okay. We're okay, baby. I think this is actually going to be good. Look, I'm not even trolling. No, it's not enough. I was thinking this is either going to be really good or it's just going to be short. And it was the latter of the two. I hit it perfectly. Like, I can't blame it on that. That was legit hit. Struck to perfection. But what we are going to do is we're going to make a birdie regardless. Because I don't care. I don't care about nothing. No. Broke too much. And it wasn't hard enough anyway. But we'll take the par. Uh, as we look down upon and the cliffside views here. Par. Beautiful course, beautiful course. And look at that. Decent putt. I played uh, a course like this in Spain. And sitting at two under four it definitely wasn't eight. as good as this course, obviously. But it was like similar. There was like the cliffside views four. and stuff. I had to use rented clubs, obviously. and Because I was just over there with my family and stuff. Uh, but me and my dad went for a round in it. And it was brilliant, man. I think I have a picture of me playing on one of the cliffs, actually. You know, it's so impressive. Not my golf, but the course. <laughs> Kick left off that off that bank. No, it's too far. Damn it. I don't know why that's so far right. Anyway, but... Whatever. I think you'll like that. We'll see. I don't really care about my score anymore. We already messed it up with that double bogey. Like, I was like, we're back in this after the four birdies in a row, and that just crushed all my hopes and dreams after that. So, I don't know. I don't really care about my score, but I'm just enjoying the views and having fun with this course. I don't know why I hit it that hard. I don't know why I hit it that hard. It wasn't actually that hard, but it was downhill for the most part, so... Maybe it was uphill towards the end. I literally didn't even read that part. Like, like, I'm not joking. I just read right the, the right to left break, and I was like, hey, I'm gonna aim way out here. I didn't really... What am I Ooh, fucking doing? Like, here. What am I doing, dude? Like, I just need to take a second and fucking relax. Like, that is embarrassing. Like, what am I away. actually doing with my life here? And now I've left myself this one. 
which is even harder than the one I just had for a, for a bogey. And we're about to get another double bogey here, unless I can hold this, which I haven't been able to. Oh, and I thought that was going to go. So we literally just had a four putt double here. Double bogey. All right, let's take Four putt double. Nice one, mate. Now. I don't know, like that was literally a tap in, and I aimed, for some reason I aimed to play the break, when I should have just hit it straight through the break, like that's what you're supposed to do with the short ones, and I literally aimed way left, for no good reason at all, and it completely fucked uh, my round up, we're back to level, imagine this round guys, I'm level par, like how crazy is that, I've made like 6 birdies, and I'm level par somehow, like I don't get it. I really don't get my play sometimes. Like I just, I I do some really good stuff, and I'm like, yeah, I'm I could, you know, I'm back on track, dude. I could really make something of this, and and then, and then like just stupid shit like that happens, and it happens every time as well. It's not like that's some infrequent thing. Like whenever that doesn't happen, I have an amazing round. Like simple as that. I have an amazing round when the dumb shit like that doesn't happen, but it always happens. Please hit the flag or something. Oh. I was struck to perfection, but just had a little bit too much place. We're kind of caught between clubs, unfortunately. But we have this for an eagle. Bounce back eagle. Go on. Give me something. Nope. Ooh, and it just misses. Can't wait to miss this one, too. <laughs> and this My putting today has been... This is probably the worst I've putted in a long time, and I've had some bad putting days recently, so... This is, yeah, yeah I think this might be the worst putt. I've putted. Like, I've made, like, one, maybe, one, maybe one decent putt. And that was the really long uphill one. I didn't really have that much break. But, like, other than that, I've been pathetic with the flat stick in my hand. And I mean pathetic. Like, really bad. Going with the 8-iron. The 8-iron. Pretty good shot. It's a little bit too far, I think. It's going to go off the green. It's a decent strike, but I thought that. I thought that it might be a little too far. And that it was uh, the green. quite unfortunate. I should have maybe hit. I don't know if the 9-iron would have been enough, though. Like, I don't know. Hit it a little bit slow, but it should be an up and down for the par. Difficult to par yeah, three here. Save par. There's definitely some difficult holes, but I've made them difficult by hitting pathetically uh, bad shots as well. <laughs> like, there's certain ones that... But the putting has been the main head. thing, to be honest. Like, the putting is 100%. I, okay, if I was putting... Like, if I was putting average, like, decent, I would be, no joke, 5 under par right now. Like, I'm not even trolling or exaggerating or anything. I'd 100% be at least 5 under par. But unfortunately, I couldn't even putt remotely average and that is way right needs to get left and it looks like he's going through the branches here on this there you one. have it that's perfect that's actually going to be legit perfect it might be in the rough there but that's fine it's the light rough i think if we had a uh, if we had hit straight down and it didn't get that kick to the left it probably would have been it would have actually ended up being in in the heavy rough ahead of us that was good that was real good Please be the right, please be the right distance. Finally, okay, and that should be a birdie. Yeah, he'll be happy with that. Five. Feet really like this course here. though. I just wish I would have putted a bit better, and played a bit better. But I like yeah, see what I mean. I barely made that. I barely made that. The greens are difficult. I'll, I'll, like I'll give myself that. They're difficult greens, but at the same time, there's no way I should be. Now teeing up for the final. Hole oh, last hole is the next one. Oh she. All along the water, wind is into us, 512 yard par 4. This is definitely difficult. Love it though. That was a slice too. That's bunker bound if I've ever seen a bunker bound golf shot. Luckily, it's going to be just short, but we're not even going to be able to reach in two out of the rough. Like, no joke. I don't think we're going to be able and to reach in two. That sat down too. That's not going to be, that yep, one. not a good lie at all. So we're going to have to aim like out here pretty much, I think. I don't even know if I'm going to get this over the bunker, to be honest. This shot looks bound for the beach, folks. Yeah. I should have just aimed even further right to the, to the fairway. That was just a horrible lie. Can't even... Can't even lie, and my voice just broke. I'm 25 years old, by the way. It's 
See, I was expecting that to come to the left a little bit because of the lie, but it didn't really. It didn't really. That's crazy. And um, pot okay. for a Six. 69 on the final round. 69 on the final round. That's for a par, by the way. Oh my god, this is going to be a difficult... I swear to god, if I make another, another double, I'm going to freak out. I'm going to freak out if I make another double, dude. Thank you. And that one will drop. I cannot believe we finished that round two under par. Like, that was the most fucking weird round I've ever had in my lifetime. Look at this. Look at this shit. Par, par, par. Bogey, par, par. Birdie, birdie, birdie. Birdie. Double. Birdie. Par. Double. Birdie. Par. Birdie. Bogey. Like, what? I had two bogeys, two doubles, and seven birdies. What a strange round to golf. What a strange round to golf. Par 71. Honestly, really disappointed with the putting and stuff like that, but um, it was it was very enjoyable nonetheless. I really like the course. Hopefully, you guys do too. Uh, make sure to play in the society. It's called the Apex Hounds Club. Uh, you know what to do, I'm sure, by now. Um, but there you have it. Uh, I'm the first one to finish my round, and I uh, had fun with it. So hopefully, you guys did it too. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the video, even despite my shitty playing. But thank you all for watching. I'll see you guys in the very near future for some more of the golf club 2019 peace out it's been my pleasure to serve you all right guys so i just wanted to take a minute to thank my members at the end of each video uh, i really appreciate the support i've got a few new members recently and uh coming in at the puppy tier which is the 199 tier i have mdg aka my boy jack and i've got rob deaton didn't i think he was saying his name is pronounced but anyway uh those that's the puppy level and then coming in at the hound level which is the standard 499 level i have brent clapper i have leanne pico daxman thiago silva Game Riot and Maximus Primus and Rocky Hulatang. I'm just gonna say Rocky because I don't know if I'm saying your second name right. And then coming in at the Wolf level, which is the 999 tier, uh, including two new members, we've got UG Outlaw, we've got Sylvan Jamies, Anthony Roberts, and Casey Woods. So thank you all for being members of the channel. It really does mean a lot. You get uh, access to the emotes, you get a badge next to your name, and you get shout out in the end of each video like this and also in the description of the video. So thank you all, and I'll see you next time.